my name is Brooklyn Lamaru. I'm lead student ambassador here at Lindenwood University, and we're going to be checking out a Linden Terrace house today. Linden Terrace is located on the northwest side of Lindenwood University's main campus. Currently, Lindenwood owns 194 houses. Linden Terrace offers duplexes and houses for juniors with 54 plus credit hours, seniors, and graduate students with a minimum cumulative GPA of 2.0. The houses range in occupancy from two-person to four-person houses. Each house is unique and comes with its own style and layout. We're currently here in one of our Linden Terrace housing options. These houses can range from two to four residents. The home that we're currently in houses four individuals here at Lindenwood. So along with their bedrooms and bathrooms that they get, they get a living space. So in here, you're welcome to bring furniture, decorate it however you'd like. They have couches and a TV that they did bring from home. But each home is gonna have a space like this, so you can decorate it however you choose. It's a nice area just to hang out with friends, invite people over, they have a gaming console in their house. Moving right along, every house here that we have on Lindenwood's campus also has a kitchen. These are all gonna come with the appliances of a refrigerator and a stove and an oven. Um, not every house has a dishwasher or a built-in microwave. If your home doesn't have one of those, the students do bring their own microwave. Some of them will, but again, not every single home here. You get a ton of space in your kitchen. Something I've really missed out on living in a dorm is not having the space to cook my own meals and things like that. Of course, our dining food hall here is delicious, but it'd be awesome to have my own space to cook, so I'm super excited to live in a house just like this one next year. Um, with the cabinet space, you can bring your own utensils, plates, bowls, things like that. Uh, you have a big sink to wash your dishes, a lot of places to store all your food and go groceries that you bring as well. Just like the living room furniture where they brought their own TVs, couches, a television stand, you would bring your own kitchen table as well. It's not required to bring anything, but you do have the space provided by the home, so you're welcome to fill it with a, whatever furniture you'd like. So here they brought a table and chairs. So like I said, this home houses four residents. So upstairs, there's gonna be two bedrooms and then down below we have two bedrooms as well. Stepping into the bedroom, you do get quite a bit of space. Uh, even our smallest rooms here, here in Linden Terrace, do have larger rooms than our single dorm rooms on campus. So you're provided with opportunity to do what you'd like with the space. Linwood does provide you with a twin extra large bed, a twin extra large mattress, a dresser, a desk, and a desk chair but all that furniture is optional. So say a student opted out and brought their own bed, you're welcome to do so, bring that into your space. The students here have decided to do that. They've also decided to bring their own desk chair. Every room is also going to have its own closet. So along with dresser space, you can bring a closet to hang your clothes in, store your shoes in as well. So down here on the bottom floor, like I said, there's two bedrooms. Those two occupants are going to share a bathroom down here. In these bathrooms, you will get a sink with underneath storage cabinet. There's also a mirror on the wall. You get a toilet, a shower, and a towel rack. You're welcome to bring any other storage items like they have above their toilet here. Um, so you do get your own bathroom for each two people that live in the house. So we are gonna head upstairs and check out another bedroom option here. Every room is kind of a different size in the houses. As you know, with college housing, you get a bunch of variety. Something cool about the houses here is that the pricing differentiation isn't very huge. So if you choose to live in a house rather than just a single room in a dorm, you're not paying a bunch more. Um, that's something that I really appreciate because you get more space, you get the opportunity to live with your other friends but still have your own bedroom. Other notable things about the houses is that they don't have a laundry room in them. You actually would go do your laundry at the Evans Commons that is free for all students, which is really nice here on our campus. So this is just another example of a bedroom in a Linden Terrace home. Again, this student has decided to bring their own bed from their house, but they did use the desk that Linwood provided. They brought their own chair. Um, they also have a much larger closet up here. So again, you get variety in these homes. So this closet is a two sliding door one. Um, something nice that this roommate chose to do is put their dresser into their closet. So this dresser was provided by Lindenwood. So they have the storage of putting their clothes into the dresser, hanging them up in the closet. They also have an upper storage shelf in here. So it's very nice. You get a lot of space to store your things and still have room in your room to do whatever you'd like in here. Just like downstairs, the two people up here on this floor will have their own bathroom. It comes with the same amenities up here. so. That's nice for the students to share. 
Other notable things to mention about Linden Terrace housing is that every single house comes with its own Wi-Fi and cable provided by the university. So students don't have to think about bringing a Wi-Fi router to their homes that is provided completely by the university to use for free here. Lindenwood is also going to have free trash pickup at these homes. That is something new that's going to be provided. So rather than having to go bring your trash to a dumpster somewhere on campus, it is going to be picked up right at the house, which I think is super awesome. I'm definitely going to enjoy that amenity next year. This little clip here is just going to give you a good idea of what a backyard or outdoor living space could look like here for our students who live in Linden Terrace. Just like I said, these houses have a lot of variety. So do their backyards. Um, back here, they have a very nice patio, a large backyard. They have decorated it with some chairs so you can hang out, come back here. Currently, this residents of this home do have a mini fridge back here. That way, if you're hanging out, it's nice outside. You can grab a water, sit down with your friends, have some snacks, maybe do your homework outside. Some students also bring their own grills. So if you do like grilling, you can have that here in your backyard. Uh, so again, it's just another space that students can hang out, do whatever they'd like. So different from a dorm, all you really have is your room. You get a living room, a kitchen, a backyard space. So it's really enjoyable for our Lindenwood students. I really just want to say thank you to you all for joining me in touring this Linden Terrace house today. Again, it is a wonderful housing option and there's so much variety on our campus and places for our students to live. If you have any further questions, feel free to contact our ResLife office. Just like our dorms on campus, we do have ResLife coordinators that are associated with Linden Terrace. You're welcome to contact them at any time or visit them at 2207 Charbo Street. That way you can get any information you might be wondering or answer any questions you may have.